at 6 o'clock. As part of Governor Cuomo's New York Works program that was unveiled on Tuesday, 2,000 miles of roads and 110 bridges will be repaired. Many of those roads are part of a facelift in the capital region. Aaron Connolly joins us now from in front of the Twin Bridges with more. Aaron. Yeah, Jody, and the twin bridges right behind me here is just one of 17 bridges in the capital region to be fixed and repaired. Yesterday, Governor Cuomo announced about $236 million is coming to our area for dozens of infrastructure improvements. Now, more than $20 million of that money will go toward work on the twin bridges on the north way. The north and southbound decks of the bridges will be replaced. That work is set to start this year thanks to state funds accelerating the process. Another local project on the list and where the bulk of the money is going is to repair and restore the Patroon Island Bridge, which carries I-90 over the Hudson River. A total of $145 million will be used for that two-year project. Many say this investment will help rebuild the economy and create nearly 20,000 jobs statewide. This is very, very good news for our infrastructure, first of all, which is in dire need of, of repair, replacement, modernization. We have nearly a third of our bridges in New York State are, uh, are either structurally deficient or functionally obsolete, and that's not a good place to be. And a couple interesting facts here. According to the Department of Transportation spokesperson, 70,000 people travel over the Patroon Island Bridge every day, 112,000 on the twin bridges. And obviously, there are many positives to improving infrastructure from safety to boosting the economy. But many people are worried about their commutes and the impact that construction could have on traffic. We're going to have much more on that later today. Jody? All right, that is our Erin Connolly reporting. And for a complete list of all of the planned projects, you can just head over to YNN.com. We have the information there for you.